hate you. <laughs> I'm sure I accepted your resignation. <laughs> okay, there you go. Here we go. Go live. Right, hang on. Show my guys. We are right. Okay, hang on. I think we are. Hang on. Yes, we are live. Show my guys. Welcome to WWC Dix. And uh, and it's just myself today. There's no anybody <laughs> else in there because they just about to take the Mickey. Now we got Josh in the house. Hello. We got Amy. Hello. And we got Dean. Morning. Yeah, Dean. <laughs> Dean, Dean is all colored, yeah. Right, Dean, bugger off. You can go back to his office. Right, guys, if you need anything for uh, design, right, if you want any words for design and stuff like that, then uh, please um, ask away. Right, Dean's on. He's going to be uh, on the on the livey thing, like so you can talk to him. Ask him any questions, yeah, on our future projects coming out. Uh, we're going to start releasing um, big projects uh, towards the, uh, the beginning of August now. Right? So it's going to give us a bit of time. We've got our MUDs coming out, um, and there's going to be other products being released uh, or, or, or revamps or more available everywhere else. Um, but we've got uh, well, our big projects, like our bridge projects and, uh, you know, and, and some other stuff that we've got coming, baseboards and stuff, lots of MDF stuff. Uh, that's going to be uh, Dean's going to be doing that, and he's he's working on some other stuff at the moment, um, just sort of revamping stuff that we've got uh, uh, that's been released that we need to tweak. Um, but yeah, so so new stuff coming out in August, right? Um, uh, so stay tuned. So ask him. You know, I mean, if you've got any design ideas, let him know. Yeah, he'll uh, he more likely um, you know, I mean, tell you to. Uh, <laughs> no, mind your own business. No, he wouldn't. Yeah, he's pretty good. You know, I mean, if you have any ideas, l l ask away. It'd be great. Uh, right, morning, everybody in the group. Yeah, uh, good luck to Sam. He's uh, he's live today. Yeah, so good luck to him. Yeah, you know, I mean, I hope not many people watch you. So <laughs> and they all watch me because <laughs> I'm better. I'm better looking. Um, and uh, I gotta first of all after something serious. I have to sincerely apologise to Amy for dirty, you know what, lovely white shoes. Yeah, okay. Uh, she come in today, all chuffed, saying, "Look at my nice new white shoes," and I my, my big foot, you know, my Frodo foot sticks a little patch on it. I feel so guilty. So I'm humbly apologising on camera, so it's on publicly on camera to Amy sitting over there. I will say, mate, that's not like it was an accident. <laughs> <laughs> it was an accident. So you know, what I mean, so I, I, there we go. I'm humbly apologising. We got, um, yeah, everybody's saying hello and stuff like that. Uh, Josh is behind. On the on the keyboard, and he should be uh, saying hello to everybody. When you know, you know, we have said good morning too, but you know, we're not going to try and get him. I got my early coffee, but Dean, I'm Stephanie. I'm in the eleven season. We love a chat. The eleven season to stop. Okay, um, how is everybody? Hope they're fine. Uh, I've been working on. I've done a little bit more um, detailing to uh, to my cliff. I'll turn it around and show you now, right? And I get the boys and the girls to show us the. Um, Oh, Josh is there as well. I get the guys to uh, show you um, uh, um, uh, some camera angles just to show you what's going on. Right? Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh my God, you did that. That's so wrong. <laughs> Are you bound to be on the, on, on the Amy side, Kelly? Yeah. I thought you weren't coming on anyway, Kelly. I thought you were going to a physio or something. You know what I mean? But right, nice to have you. Nice to see you putting me before the physio. That's brilliant. Lovely. I love the commitment. Awesome. <laughs> Okay, uh, so, yeah, I've been doing a little bit more detail. I haven't done any more colouring. I'm quite happy with the colouring, I think. Uh, uh, Amy's photos last week are ten times better than Josh's. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> uh, right. Um, we, uh, you know, I mean, I think they showed the colours up. Uh, the weather and powders really, really make it look really like stone, doesn't it, guys? Yeah, right, it does. It makes it look really, you know I mean, a um, uh, stone effect. I've got some white bits that I can see coming through, and I'm and literally about two minutes before I come on air, come on air, well, yeah, came on air, right? I literally um, knocked a corner and it's uh, got a little white spot. But I, I'll, I'll show you what we can do. Uh, that's on the 21st. Oh, right, yeah, okay, so, oh, yeah, you did see the 21st. So, um, and there's little white bits when I've been doing uh, work, but we can hide all that. Uh, so what I've done, I've added some roots, like I was going to, but I'll show you what I did with the roots, right, with the, with the uh, green stuff. Uh, and I've added a bit of roots to come down, and we'll try and, Josh, to try and get in to, uh, to, to close, uh, close with the camera. Oh, incidentally, if you do your camera clicking and, and or you see a pair of hands coming into shot every now and then, that's only Amy, because we want to get a few more shots for social media, for, you know, I mean, for afterwards, you know, I mean, because we... We recognise that the, the video cameras, as good as they are, sometimes doesn't show the the, the best angle or doesn't show the, 
the detail that much. So we try to get it while I'm doing while I'm doing it, so we we can show up a better um, uh, uh, we can show up a, a better um, uh, what am I trying to say? Angle. Better mm-hmm. angle. There we are. Better shot. There we are. See. Yeah. Yeah, more detail. There we are. It could have said any of those, but I couldn't get it out. <laughs> you know me, I'm babbling. You know me, babbling idiot. Um, but I, I'm looking at one by a piece, and I'm going into one now. But I'm, there's a piece for you. It's stunning. I know you can't. Oh, he swapped the camera. That why he swapped it. And um, he's got that shot in there. Uh, I'm going to show you. It. Right now, it looks awesome. Yeah, but we'll we'll get some food, good shots. Uh, there's some there's some figures in there that I painted as well. Yeah, right. You know I mean, uh, we'll show you later. They 28 mil scale these are so th- this is a bit bigger so just to show you what I you know I mean but I'm going to show you how I was going I was going to go with uh, our models uh, and then obviously then when we release like uh, uh, this to the war game inside then we can you know I mean you know if anybody sees the photos you know that you see that right okay uh, <laughs> okay so we got 19 people in so far let me have a slurp okay right what's the best angle Josh for this two. I can't, can they see? They can't see. Go yeah, three. Go above. Yeah. Go above. Oh, just above. If I think I might come up. Yeah, there we are. If you've seen, right, this is green stuff, okay, or key tonight, right? Or in a, in a uh, probably diorama, wargame, and hobby, right? It's known as green stuff, right? Um, there it is. I, Josh was fluffing it around with me. Right? I was just about to pull it up anyway. Yeah, a two part uh, putty, basically, right? Okay. Um, Brilliant stuff, right? You can sculpt out of it and all sorts of things. So what I've done is made a root base, right? Okay, and what I'm going to do, I've already made start making uh, started to make a tree, uh, and then we're going to glue it in to that like that piece, right? So go to two, they might be able to see a bit better. Yeah, there we are, right? So something like that, right? Okay, it doesn't stay in now, but that's something I'm going to do to so, so start off with. Right, okay. Um, now I've, I've done it already and I've made it. Uh, I, I did it Monday because I wanted it to go off. Yeah, because it, it go, takes a while, but it's solid now, right? And it's stuck in there, all done, right? And I painted, I have painted it, and I'm happy with the colour, but what, what colour it is as well. But I am going to add a little bit of foliage and stuff like that, right? Okay. Um, and you can see there's a little, I don't know if you can see it, there's a white spot, yeah, where the, right there where the plaster. Where the plaster's come through yeah. or the paint has come off, right? But again, you know, I mean, we're gonna sort of, I'm gonna try and put um, some foliage and stuff like that on there. To work out. I'm also gonna try and do sort of like a maybe roughly around about here, a, a, an orchid, a delicate orchid, okay? Yeah, or up here maybe, uh, right? Um, and, and then some like use it again. All you might, you know me, sea form to get the uh, thing around. Uh, what, what I'm trying to say, the detail into it. Yeah, so I'm going to get it all at the base for there. You know, I mean, maybe put some just dead grass on spots up there. Just to just if I then put this onto a diorama, yeah, I can blend that grass into it then, and then maybe a bit of sea foam. Right, actually, I've got a bit of dead sea foam over there, which Josh knows where it is. In the, oh, oh there, there, color, right? uh, it's in a different colour, so if he passes that to me now, I can I can show you which. Then I can use that then. Yeah, that's, that, that, well, that's, that's perfect. Yeah, look, I mean, that, there's a there's sort of a live. Uh, where are we going, Josh? Oh, you can see it there. You can see it there. It's so, like so. You can see the green on that. Yeah, you know what I mean. And I'm gonna spray that uh, with layering spray, and you know what I mean. And then put some foliage on it. Right, not a lot. I don't want too much on there. Like, right? it's got to be bare up there anyway. Like, right? because it's a bit. You know what I mean? It's barren wasteland at the end of the day. And then I'm gonna put that dead bit spots on that. Then maybe. But there, but there, and maybe up around there, just to add the detail a little bit more. Okay, uh, and obviously then I got, like I said, I always keep your little cutoffs. Yeah, and I got some small little cutoffs in there. Um, you know what I mean? Where where we can cut, fat, cut it right down and then put little flowers on top of that. Yeah. So, so yeah. So basically, we're gonna get into it. So let me gonna show you now first. I'll do make roots with putty. I'm gonna put that over there. Where, where are we gonna put that over there? Okay, right. Um, let's put that put there. I got, we've, we, I don't know. You're not, you're not going to notice, right? You will not notice that we have moved, <laughs> right? Because it's black and black and black. But yesterday, right, in the final hour of yesterday's, where that uh, Amy goes, I got a good idea. Let's move, and we moved, right? You know what I mean? And the three of us were like wires everywhere, and we're kind of, so I'm now when I used to sit like that, I'm now sitting like that. Yeah, you're not going to notice, right? But it's and I got a nice big, t- big, massive TV over there as well. Um, 
when the webcam's on the floor, which we can't use because it's too short worker, but I would have shown you otherwise and had a quick show showing you wrong. But anyway, so it's a lot better. It's just, well, I can see the mess on their side of the room. My side of the room is always tidy. Their side of the room is always messy, and I keep telling them clean up, but they never listen to me. So, uh, okay, so um, yeah, so two part. Pop, 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 see, I go into one and look at it. Two part epoxy, uh, putty, right? That's, um, that's all it is, right? Blue and yellow to make green, right? Cut it. What are you two laughing at? Taking a Mickey. We're laughing for once. The table's straight. The table's straight. Yeah. <laughs> Is that zoomed in enough? Do you want me to zoom in? I think it's good. Yeah, we're happy yeah. with that. Guys, yeah. can you see that? Yeah. I thought I was. I thought you was looking at the at the screen the wrong way. Ah, yeah. What do you mean? Yeah. See, so there, my Kelly. this, yeah. Well done. You we can't see me now because we haven't got the the smaller one. Uh, right. So just I just cut a little bit off. Right. Small little bit. To be honest, a small bit goes a long way. I am going to zoom in a bit more, Josh. You are. You're wrong, right? I've also moved the mic as well, so hopefully that uh, you, you, no one's turned on and said I can't hear you. So uh, uh, we're all going through all the mornings, yeah. Okay, so we'll collect right. Um, Twenty-one people, three likes. Come on, spanners, where's my spanners? Three likes, yeah. Uh, just all I'm doing. It, it is quite sticky, right? Um, so uh, Dave, Dave Eastfield, yeah, our head of design, he tends to he use he sculpts figures and all sorts of things out of this right yeah to be fair uh, but <laughs> through the video yesterday right because we were doing a video for for war world gaming and dave's gonna head up that bit not me right and we we're all giggling we we're all behind him all giggling because he just sort of washes the water in the it washes his brush in the water and he guys right and then goes <laughs> and then we, and then we, you know it's stinking with that water and he's done that for years and i mean i mean like years why so, did you get COVID? Yeah, right? yeah. You know what I mean? It's immune a, system of uh, it's a, yeah, it's immune system of watercolor. Because you know, you dirty watercolor water. It's just natural thing, just to go. I can't wet the brush because you know, what I mean, a phenomenal painter. I don't think anybody can say, but it's all in the saliva. It's all in the saliva. So, but then, yeah, it, it, once you start wetting this a little bit as well, it, it gets rid of that tackiness then as well, right? And you can use it a little bit more. It is fiddly, right? I well, done a few of those. I was like, oh, and had to pull it off. But here we go. Uh, I'm just gonna have a quick read. Uh, do you have a video making bushes, not small ones, the large ones? Uh, I'm not sure what the best to use. Okay, let me. Um, you want a horse then? Okay, wait. Uh, yeah, rubberized horse head. Have I got rubber? We, we haven't done, done a rubberized horse head, have we? No, I'm just looking at Josh because Josh is my editor. Is it chief editor? Producer, I think. Producer, yeah. there are, producer. <laughs> chief. Top, top dog. Top, chi no, I won't go that far. <laughs> uh, right, okay. Um, rubberized horse. Any rubberized horse here? Just give me a, give me a, give me some one let strip, and I'll show you. I'll quickly show you this stuff. Right. Well, you know, I mean, it takes hours, days to go off. Right. You know, what I mean, and, and when it starts to go, a uh, sort of hard. Right. You can, you can just. Keep on putting heat back into it by playing it and then and reuse it. So I'll stick. If Josh hurries up, I'll stick this back. Uh, give me a little bit. Right. So uh, rubberized horse hair. Yeah, we sell it in an A4, A5, and, all, and strips and all sorts of things. Right. But what you can do, uh, clump foliage. Right, guys. It, I I don't. I do like it. And I'm going to make loads of it before long, right? Oh, Josh, that. Yeah. You know, my assistant, lovely assistant, right? I do like it, but it's too solid. It's, i got a bit of clump foliage for you. Can you pass me a diorama? Small diorama, not a large. I just want to show the guys, just show the guys a little bit about this. i got, I got plenty of room here now. That will, that will do. Lovely. Okay, so little, just i got a little diorama by you now, right? So Josh picks an angle, and then we can go from there, right? The clump foliage, right? I, I mean... Oh, that way, yeah, okay, right. Uh, boom, look how solid that is. Go to two, Josh, to see if they can see it on that one. Yeah, look how solid, it's just a massive lump, okay? I'll come over, right? Yeah, okay, it's just a massive lump, right? Even when it, it, it's a solid object, right? Even when you break it up, okay? Yeah, it's just, you know what I mean? To me, it looks, it needs something else. Yeah, it's too solid, right? Okay, I, I feel, right? I like. I like to see see through the bush, 
uh, or see through the, you know, I mean, to, to, to have it sort of not so as, as thick as that. Right, so I've got a three again, just so we can work out. So all, all we do now, right, I mean, I've got a square, right, but it's just break it up because you want this to be the carrier, okay, right? I'm so, sorry, I'm just working on answering, um, I think, Mark, is it, a uh, main train? Uh, well, well uh, guys, I'm useless with names, right? I, you know what I mean? I, I forget my own. <laughs> so, uh, main train at work at Eastport. Let me know uh, your name again, buddy. Right? Now, you, you need to put in brackets your name, so I know. Um, I know Bri. Bri, yeah, I've been talking to Bri, so Bri just popped up. Andy's in. Andy, I'm in. How are you? Okay, so all I'm doing is just teasing the the uh, the the. the uh, ho rubberized horse set out, right? Okay, to a to a bush. I mean, and that you can also do it long, long, or you can have it as a, you know I mean, as a bush, as a as a, a bulk bush, but there, that type of thing. Okay, and then you can also. Uh, I'm just trying to get rid of the mask because I want to see again. Want to see through it. If the more you see of your grass, or the more you see of your diorama. As opposed to doing a, a line like that. I mean, you can add bits of this into it if you want to. Oh, I've done something. Sorry. That's the mouse is in the way. Get rid of the mouse, man. No yeah, you can add bits to it. I don't mind little bits to it. But I personally, it's only my personal thing, right? I just don't think that looks right. You know what I mean? Just two, please. Just so I can go to that. Yeah. Oh, Amy. Oh, that's Amy. Like. <laughs> I don't know where to go. <laughs> I didn't know where to go. Right, okay. So, yeah, I just don't think, you know, I mean, it looks all right. I suppose you can add it with it, but if you've got that that sort of whole set through, and then what you can do, right, this is what another thing. So, Amy is behind me now, right? So, can you, if you hear some clicking, it's not me or my joints, it's Amy. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to look for the foliage. Uh, so, we've got some of that, uh, some of that. Well, look, we'll do the um, uh, one of the we've got, we've got some other stuff in as well that I want. Okay, and we got some of that experience advert. Is it experience advert? Have you seen that where they're on the on the side? Yeah, wholesale. Uh, yeah, and then just layering spray again. This, you know, I mean, our layering spray. It, 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 I use it for everything. Like, you know, I mean, it's such a versatile product. Like, you know, I mean, so. Straight over the top. I mean, you can glue this down. Bit of basing glue if you want. Basic, we'll put basing glue down, right? And then, you know, I mean, once it's glued there, then spray around. Again, the spray won't. You won't see the balls, and you won't see the. Um, uh, you won't see the whiteness of it because it dries matte. Yeah, and then sprinkle. Okay. Uh, is there any yellow? Flock over there. Flock oh, sorry, Josh, change the camera angle. He didn't tell me that. Not, not the best angle, Josh. No, oh, well, that's a bit better. I can. Okay, so I can see in the front that we haven't done it. Oh, they are perfect. Okay, uh, I'm just going to go. Different tone now, right? Again. Make sure I got this lid on. There's no, no, no of me today with my track red or today. I'll probably kick it over and spill spill it. Amy's right beside me. Gonna clout me. A uh, <laughs> little bit of a, a bit more spray. Okay, and then just. So we've got you know a couple of tones on there. Otherwise, it just looks like a mass of green and. Yeah, so we make a hawthorn bush, okay? A bit more spray again. We're gonna have to go to two. I'll I'll take it all. I'll bring it over to two when you see it now, right? So not yet, Josh. And then uh, I was looking at hawthorn bushes the other day, right? And the flower is quite pronou uh, pronounced on it when in the summer. So I'm gonna put it quite thick on there. Just to show it, I mean, the guys are happy now because we've just made a, a, a pretty pants um, diorama and you know, we've just added a little bit of height to it, you know what I mean? So again, this is adding your height as well because uh, you've got textures and, and height um, to do with 
uh, anything with modeling yeah you know what i mean you want you just don't want to flat you like the with the old sawdust it just used to be flat yeah and you had to try then use your clump foliage and stuff like that to bring it up right um now you've got like the rubberized wholesale or the sea foam you know what i mean my sea foam that i use for, for flowers and stuff like that the static grass going from two mil up to six mil or ten mil you know what I mean? it's all about height it's all about seeing that 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 movement and stuff like that because it makes it look a lot lot better okay i mean this is just quick uh, and i was looking at literally driving home the other day as i do looking at a hawthorn bush thinking hmm i don't put as many flowers on there as i normally do right okay what's that it grass looks I, I i'll go back to questions in order so i'm gonna just go come over number two please josh right come over and then show you so that's something you know I, mean, I literally knocked that up in a couple of minutes yeah right okay you know what i mean and there it is it's quite high that's quite tall you know what i mean that's probably big for for old gauge but double old gauge but i just wanted to show you that, that that's what you can do and if you want larger bushes uh, you want you're not going to get any better than you know what i mean than, than um uh, rubberized wholesale. A lot of people don't like to use it because they just tend not to really know what to, how to use it. Yeah, you know what I mean? So, all it is, tease it out as best you can, right? Um, you know what I mean? Uh, and then you've got, you can see, you can see, if you look, yeah, if I put my hand, you know what I mean? You can see through the bushes, uh, you know what I mean? That is, that, that's awesome. Because that will give you such, you know what I mean? There it does, doesn't it? Josh, we're just shaking his head. It'll give you so many different uh, angles, you know what I mean? If you've got a logo going through there, then, you know what I mean, you, you go through there, you'll see it. And that's what you want. You don't want a block. If you put a block there, right, you know what I mean? Or, call it, you, or if I put it in front so you can see. Yeah, if you put that block there, it, it, straight away, you can't see anything. And if, for me, it ruins it. You know what I mean? I'm not to say don't use clump foliage because, again, uh, if we go to three... Right, we can use a bit of clump foliage around here, right? You know what I mean? But but this is where we make it nice and small, okay? You know what I mean? Not not a big you don't want you want little areas, you know what I mean? And then what you could do then is maybe add a little bit of static grass around it to blend it in. Josh, I'm gonna have to go to two again. Uh, you know what I mean, just to show you what I've done on the colour. Yeah, so there, there's the clump foliage. Yeah, but it's added, you know what I mean? Turn it on the other way so you guys can see the other way then as well. Yeah, it's just well look, there's a, look at that bush. Look at that shot there. You swear that's real. Yeah? Mm. Well, anyway, you know what I mean? I got to be fair, Amy's right beside me, but yeah, so. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so you know what I mean. There there we are, a little bit of masterclass quickly, right? On you know what I mean, on just a well I say masterclass, you know what I mean? Uh, something simple, but there we go, job done. Okay, so I hope that answered me. Yeah, you know what I mean? Uh, that, that was just our, our, okay, our foliage just coming out. Let me answer the um, uh, main train. I'm pretty sure that's Mark. Right? So, you know what I mean? If it's not, I do apologise, right? Do you want okay. that there, Ron? You've got the sprinkler stuff on it? What sprinkler stuff? Hang on, Josh is talking to me. I do apologise, guys. He's, he's showing me something. Ah, uh, Lee. That's right, Lee. Sorry, mate. You're looking for that question, do you? Uh, what does it look like with the grass? Oh, hang on, let me, let me go through it. So, yeah, Lee, I hope that's uh, helped out, mate. Yeah, yeah love it. Oh, you know what I mean? Andy, Andy's a pretty good modeler, you know what I mean? He knows what he's talking about sometimes. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, yeah, you know what I mean? Anything to do uh, with, with, with um, rubberized horse I In fact, I don't use it a lot, uh, but now saying out these questions and what I call it, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Mark. <laughs> anything. Call me anything. I'm modeling with the the village idiot. There we are. I mean, I mean giggling where you talking about the about your brush. <laughs> okay, so um uh I'll have to do uh, a show actually next week we might do it. Cause it, we that we could use this within the forest. Mm. I got an idea of making a forest this next week, like, you know, but I want to show you that it's just not a clump, that's just, just like a smooth base with trees into it. I want to bring in, uh, using green stuff, yeah, roots over rocks, yeah, some maybe some uh, wood, I'm talking to the guys as well, some uh, dead trees and stuff like that, you know what I mean, where moss grows over the top, and I want to show you how we can make moss. Uh, anyway, there's, there's the plans, anyway, that's 
something else. I'm, I'm supposed to be doing the desert one. I don't <laughs> want to come over here. I've, I've gone on the grass again. Yeah, you know what I mean? So, uh, Andrew G, is it possible to buy a small applicator mesh screen for the micro? No, sorry. There's we only do one type for the micro. Uh, for the for the micro, uh, the the three heads are on the um, the grand. Okay, so that's one. Uh, Mark, I got a vid. Uh, now to do to my bush Friday. Yeah, the one. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, that was very impressive. Cool. Uh, Mark, yes, giggling. I mean, uh, yes, please. Yeah, okay. So, no, well, we, we'll, I'll try to incorporate in something. Is it a question up? Right, okay. Hang on, there's a question up. Josh is shouting at me. Maybe we should have a Josh. Uh, hang on, sorry, I'm scrolling up the model what I call it. Best place to buy it from my uh, website. Should have it for us. Lee, Mark, John, Peter, Paul, Michael. Um, I can't find it. Right. I'm going to give the mouse to Josh, and then Josh can ask later on or something like that. Right. Okay. So back to the milli putt. Let's get back to the no, no, no. The green stuff. Milli putt's the same thing, but green stuff I'm using. Excuse me while I have a slip. Josh, nobody want to have a slip. We should go to camera three so nobody can see me doing it. But he's got it on full camera. Anyway, right. So yeah, you can see that was sitting there for a while. Now, right. Um, I need to get rid of that. Give up, Josh. <laughs> right. I need. Uh, right. Okay. Um, but it's still malleable, yeah? It's still be able to, to use. Gone a bit sticky. Uh, wet your fingers. Right, okay. I, I don't, you know what I mean? Dip them in water or something. Don't, don't do what I just did and lick them. <laughs> don't do a Dave. Don't do a Dave, right? Okay. Right. Uh, and just work out. So to me, that's malleable enough, right? And all we're doing, right? We just rep it. Well, all we're doing is look at, look at nature, okay? Right? Um, if you look at nature, you see the roots and you see the work on. Now, give me Dave's little little diorama that he's done, the water diorama that he's done. I think there might be roots on that that he's done, or it might not be. If it's not, don't bother. Okay, there it is. Right. All we're doing, right, is rolling it out. Okay, right, and you can make it as long or as small as you want. Okay, is the roots in there? Is he done roots? Millie putts. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So if I try and can we get in there? Can we see it? In there, maybe right. Okay, well, uh, let me get a pointer. Let me get a small pointer. So, Josh, you must have been on attack this because it's broken. So in there, you can just about see the roots in there. Right, that's merely put. Dave has done that. Can you see it? Just maybe. That's not the best of angles. Yeah, he's got roots. Yeah, in there. Okay, growing in there. I'm sure there's some photos somewhere. We'll have some photos of this somewhere. What a colour. We'll get it on, right? Okay. Um, all the apostles. That's not, the pro box works well. With it, so. Yeah, the pro box, great. Yeah, Andy, right. Okay. Um, so all we do is just to represent uh, represent a tree root, yeah? And I've done it. Th that was quite thick because the, 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 the thing was thick, right? The, 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 br the trunk was thick. I've done it thin because obviously it's starting to grow down and when it starts to grow down it, it gets thinner and obviously I've done it then into, if I get that, uh, yeah, I've obviously done it then into uh, that there, yeah, okay, Josh can you drop down and close teams, I if you can, okay, yeah, yeah, just because it's, you know, I, mean, I don't know whether it's coming up on the screen or not, right, okay, um, no, I'm cool. Right, okay, and I've done it. So, sorry, guys, bit of technical issue there. And I mean, Josh failed again. So. <laughs> uh, and, and I've done it in the, in the grooves. So, so I followed it in the grooves and stuff like that. Right? And then I've got sort of and them coming around you. I'll get some close ups, and if not, you can't see it. Uh, I'm sure Josh and Amy will get some cracking photos for us. Right? And all, all we do, right, is literally, right, and I'll do it if we go to three now, Josh, yeah, right? And I'll do it on you, right, so you can see it. Okay. Uh, do you know what the working time is of green stuff? Uh, well, the 24 hours, I think. The working time is a couple of hours, a few hours. You, you can go back to it and keep keep them, and we keep work play, playing around with it. Like, I mean, so there, there's sort of a, a, a route. You can bring it down a bit more if you want to, right? And then all you do is just shape it yeah, into that sort of root shape. I mean, there are, ta da. Yeah. I know it's small, but then all you do then is um, tweezers. Pick it up, and then you present it to the model, which I'm not going to put it onto the model, but I'm going to try and do it. Well, I'll do it on you. I'll do it on you. Oh, well, this is a, the toolkit, right? And I'll do it on a white base like that. Right? This is this is quite nice. Oh, well, I'll do it that way. So we'll do it 
sort of one there. Okay. Now this is flat, so it's going to be, you know, I mean, I, I haven't got any like rocks or something like that to raise it over the top. I want to try and get it so it's held down. So I'm going to paste that onto the work So I've sculpted that now. Yeah, that just that little bit because you can see it really is sticky, right? Sometimes and it's a pain sometimes to <laughs> to put it down. Okay, but always have a bit of water or something like that, right? And just because then it doesn't stick to you. There we are. So so that's one root down. So we'll make another one now, just to show you a, a root base, a base. A, you know what I mean? Yeah, a root base. Then right? Okay. better with a sculpting tool right so you've got a nice thin thin bit by there right on the sculpting tool a nice wide to, to you know what I mean to, to sculpt it around and then the other tool we have got then uh, yeah is getting into the grooves if you need to and then obviously a nice sharp one and a flatter edge that side there. so I'm going to use this one on the smaller edge yeah now we're going to just sort of move the root around. Bear with me, it will work. <laughs> I can start with some sticking. Okay, make another one now. Give me a nice small one. Get it up. Okay, and then just making a sort of a a root version of it. Is there any large stones we got over there, Amy? Oh, I've got something else. I got a bit slate. Yeah, I got a bit slate. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So all I'm gonna do is just to show you to go over the top of a stone. So I just want a nice, nice piece. There we are. Okay. So I'll put that sort of like that, and then we'll, we'll get it up coming over the stone. So I want to make this a little bit longer now, right? So just keep rolling it out a bit more. Look at my, I look, look at that colour on my hand. Mm. No, just, sorry. It's a fiddle. Yeah, we just, we just, look, it looks like I've got, I look like a David Dickinson. <laughs> <laughs> deal or no deal? No, it's not deal or no deal, is it? It's di di Dickinson's deals or something, isn't it? Something like that. Dickinson's real deal. Is it Dickinson? Oh, you know. Like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm going to sort of try and get this now over the top there. So place it, drop it down first. Place it down first. I'm going to gap, and then I'm going to sort of sculpt it into so it doesn't move. Uh, I'm going to need my glasses for this. Now. Uh, don't worry about that bit by there, because we can, you know, I mean, we'll hide it. We can hide it with a, you know, with a tree root or something like that. You know, I mean, a stump or something. All I'm doing is just so it's, and then we'll get it over, over the root like that. Okay, I mean, it's a bit awkward because the, the stone is not stuck down and the yeah, no what? yeah, something like that, and then move it around a bit. Yeah, starting to look good. Yeah, looks a bit weird. Looks like um, Debbie Spider in the watercolor. Oh, that was a good shot. Yeah, you can just sort of see the height a little bit on there. on there. I mean, this is just showing you what I what you can do with with the what I call with the tree root and milliput uh, uh, the green stuff. Yeah, deal on you, no deal. Right, 
Right, thanks, mate. All the best. If I if you're not gone, you know what I mean. Thank you for joining. I just got rid of my coffee. So just all we're doing is just making some, just the tree roots, just to show you a little bit, and then I can move on on to the. Oh, God, I'm, I do apologize if I'm doing it out the shot. Yeah, I am. So I just rolled it out. I got yeah. There's there's the piece. I need to come over here a bit more. That we need to bring that over a bit more, don't we? And then just pick another one. Place it down, and there we go. Yeah, so that's sort of like a root system. Yeah, it's as simple as that. Okay, spider on the brain, me of course. <laughs> it does look like a spider. It does look like a spider, yeah. You know, you know what I mean? I to maybe add a little bit, one more to get rid of the spider, the spider look. Yeah, you happy with that? Yeah, he's going to try and see the Okay. Amy's, uh, Amy's around me filming with the camera, so. I mean, it's not just tree roots. This isn't, you know. I mean, you can make so much more out of it. Maybe go of that going back over the rock again. Yeah, once it's dry. I mean, we we make a lot thicker ones as well, where then you can put the the you can sort of, I mean, scribe in the um. Sort of some detail into it, so you can pick it up when you highlight it, and you can pick it up. Just gonna... Yeah, so that's sort of gist of it, what you can do, right? You know, what I mean, uh, it's just a tree root. You know, what I mean, uh, a, a simple tree root system that we've done, uh, just using the the, the, the work on. That's what I pretty much done on them. And I did a nice long ones. Uh, if I can get into a shot, uh, if I did some nice long ones. You know, what I mean, on that. Right, oh, we go that way. Uh, oh, 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 we go here, yeah, we go here. Yeah. See, so you can see that I started off there, right? And you know, what I mean, I got a sort of a um, some some there, yeah. And I have painted it, but I kept some of the bright green as well, the bright brine, because I wanted it as a sort of live in as well. And then it follows then all the way down there, yeah. Okay, and oh, come on, mate, and then into there, yeah. Okay, so uh, that's basically. The, the first bit that we've done. So the next thing we're going to do now is going to start attaching the tree right to the uh, work of it. I, I, I hope that, you know I mean, helped. You know I mean, it's good stuff. It, it takes a bit to get used to, right? But you can add some really great detail with it. Like, you know I mean, you can, you know I mean, it, it's, it's really smart sometimes when you, uh, you know I mean, uh, when you're doing. Um, when you're modeling with that and you add, uh, want to add that extra detail so in the bushes you can add that you know what I mean a, a tree root a, a stump so you can make a stump out of that yeah you know what I mean type thing let me so let me get over the earth so make a stump out of that okay right um, that type of thing yeah you can carve in then you know what I mean using a, a blade or something to get some yeah that type of thing Okay, and this is just quick, right? You need to so, but you want to get it so it's like it's been cut or or what I call it, and then just keep going with the with the detail. Yeah, it's fat. Stick it up. I mean, this is my just the waste that I got for you, so you can do it. You know, I mean, and again, you can. Spend a bit more time than I am, you know what I mean? But there are, that, 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 you can't see, you can see just a green blip, but I'm pretty sure Amy will get a photo of that. Yeah, just, yeah. you know, it looks pretty good. And then you just chuck it on top of that, you know what I mean? Once it's dry, yeah, paste it on top of that. It's probably gonna not come off here now, right? So, or you could have sculpted it in place. Yeah, otherwise just come out as a green mess. <laughs> But if you put it on top, you know what I mean, as a, uh, you know what I mean, that type of thing. Yeah, 
put it on top of there as a trunk or work on it and then you know I mean blend it in a bit more and off you go. It's as simple as that, yeah. Right, and the rock comes off. Again, height, all height. Yeah, that's all that, that my, my theme at the moment is get your 3D look going into it. Okay? So something simple. Job done. Right, okay, let's get back to modeling. Well, we were modeling, we were going to model. Amy's taking a photo now. Come on, Amy. Okay, so I'm moving it now, right? Right, okay, so I want that angle. Yeah. No, Josh, that angle. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 there we go, there's Amy. That's <laughs> okay, so uh, we need to go up on that now, don't we, guys? So I guess I'm going to start modeling up here. Okay, right? Right, so flip the camera a minute. So. Right, okay, there we are. Um, so I'm gonna, let me tip it that way, right, so you can just see the worker. What I'm doing is gonna add, so I've done the seafoam tree worker. So that, that stalk there, right, well you can't see it. That stalk there, right, is uh, from my back garden of my apple tree. So that's an apple tree branch, right, that I've used. And I've used it because, and I've sort of cut that edge. Um, let me get away from these points. I've cut that edge. Yeah, right, to, to slope because it does sort of slope. You can see that, yeah, that roundness there, right, okay. Um, which fits perfect into that. Can you go up? Can I go to that now? Yeah. Yeah, that one, perfect. Yeah, which fits perfect onto what that area I did with there and into the groove that I cut. Uh, and I, I fluked that. <laughs> it was a genuine fluke. Yeah, and all we're going to do is I'm going to put a spot of uh, super glue over there. Stick it in, right, into where I want it, onto there, in there, right, and then leave it go off. And once it's go off then, then I'm gonna build up a little bit of small bit of foliage on top of this. Yeah, you know what I mean? And then maybe some bushes on the top over here. Delegate bushes on the top over here. And the guys will have to zoom out a bit more. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? So they can I can see where I put. And then just add some more detail going around. So first first things first. I need to present that to it and make sure that I get it where I want it. Yeah, so I'm going to look. Yeah, I'm happy with that. It's growing, growing within that, within the, uh, the the recess that I've done. Okay, so all I'm going to do is pull up a bit, open the super glue, get rid of the lid. Bob super glue. Get my activator. Put it in. Make sure. Oh, bless you. Sorry. Make sure we right. Yeah, happy with that. And then activate. So like robot walls then. Activate. Okay. Oh, well, that's stuck in there. I'm gonna leave that free. Yeah, because I'm quite happy with that. That's pretty stuck quite well. But I need to build some some stuff around here because I think it's just it's growing out of it. So again, this is where I might use a bit of milliput. So green all set. that green. Oh, I keep calling it milliput. <laughs> it's the same thing. Milliput is a, a little bit more um, grittier. I think I don't know. I don't know what the, the, the word. I'm trying to find a word. It, it's more industrial. This is yeah. far. This is smoother. Yeah, more industrial. Yeah, well, Josh, well done. It's good for something. So I'll, I'm going to just blend in a little bit of the soil just to get rid of the seam a bit. You know what I mean, so it might not work, and I might have to take it off, right? So a little bit at a time, and put my specs on so I can see. Okay, and all I'm doing is because it's just like a it's sitting there on top of the thing, so I need to blend in. Can you get that? Yeah. Let me see it. Yeah. Josh is creeping around again. Josh, they know you're here. <laughs> Amy's creeping around now as well. <laughs> okay, so all I'm doing is just sort of Getting rid of that harsh cut off, if you know what I mean, where um, that area over there is just literally 
was just sitting on top of the root weeds, the, the roots, and it didn't look right. So I'm going to bring a root if I can now, right? Roll a root here. A thin, small root. And join it to that root there if I can. Again, right guys, if you can't see what I'm doing over here, don't worry, I got I got the two maestros in today, they'll take some lovely photos of it and we'll, we'll take it from there. Okay, so there's a root that's joining into the root, I'm sort of... There's another root, can you see it? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah, so we are... And that's just sort of blended that bit in now. I'm going to come across, right, just to show you. Okay. Yeah, it's just, it looks a bit rough at the moment, right, but trust me, I will get that. Yeah, can you see it? Okay, all I'm trying to do is just sort of blend in that. Maybe if I go comma three, Josh. Sorry if my head's in the way, but... Okay, so I'm just sort of smoothing off, and I've got this broken up there, but it looks really nice. I might make another smooth root. So we got some more. The it's just breaking up that, yeah, th th that harshness. And I got one little bit, but there now I can see where it's the work. So I might bring a root coming down here. If I can. I might have to stand up and have a look at the top. Lift it up a bit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so all, all I'm going to show you is that bit by there that I've got. I'm going to come down a bit more now. I've got a root at the back, so I might come round this way a bit. Drops everything. I had to go on for my glasses as well. I'm glad I did now because there's no way I could have done this without my glasses. I can't see it. <laughs> trying to get it on to the to the tree. Can we see that? Yes. Yeah. Okay. You can see the sort of the weeds and the and what I call it. And sorry, the um, the roots growing down and 
how we just blended that in. Yeah, you know what I mean? So, you know, what we're going to add now, I, I can wear the powder that, and they've got to be careful now because that milli putt now is not going to dry it for uh, a couple of hours now, you know what I mean? But I'm going to try and gently brush some uh, some some dust in there and stuff like that where you get so maybe some concrete earth and stuff like that and I mean the dust colour maybe that, that, that'd be nice so okay I'm happy with that that's, that's come out quite nice actually so that's just that's, that is green stuff it's called Kedonite right but it's green stuff yeah that's what it's the trade name is green stuff yeah, the, or the, 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 the name that people know is it right, okay let me have a look to see if anybody my layout gets covered uh, in the can make a pool movie spiders, yeah. Uh, could Josh leave a link to the horse hair? I, I think Andy's just done it for us. Thank you, Andy. Uh, can you paint the green stuff uh, with what? Uh, right, yeah. Um, Settle car, yeah, 68. Let me know your name, please, mate. Uh, yes, you can. I have painted this, so I used, uh, I painted, uh, I'll show you now this lump. Right, uh, I'll flatten this lump out and I'll show you that, uh, what you can paint it with. Right, uh, any any modern modern paint I use Vallejo because we got Vallejo. Right, okay, right. So we go on to white again now. Right, okay. Uh, once it's dry, obviously it's much easier to paint because it goes hard. Right, okay. I've painted the the roots there. Okay, these these roots coming down. I've already coloured them. Right, and I'll show you what the colours that I've used. Right, okay. So you know, right, um, which was that one and that one. And I mix them in to get a, a nice darker colour and I get my palette. There we go. And we'll get a brush. Um, and we'll use that to clean the brush. I uh, can't see. Right, okay, let me zoom out. Right, so Josh is shouting at me. Zoom out, you can't see. Right, so and let me get rid of my tools as well. So I got a bit of a cleaner area here. Otherwise, again, I get shouted at by the producer, Josh. <laughs> Let me get comfy. Get in my way. Get out my way. Okay, right. Uh, right, okay, so this colour is uh, US dark green, okay? Um, so you can't see it, I'll show you around. 70893, alright, okay, so just a small blob of that. <laughs> Ah, I love these little drop of pots. A really small, tiny bit of that. That's all you need, right? And then, <laughs> and then a little tiny bit of that. Now, well, that's all you really need, right? For what I got, not that whop and grip big thing. It's a good job I got stocks and stocks of it. You know what I mean, typical. You know, it always good. Never work with kids or paint, <laughs> right? Okay, so little bits. Work on it. Get the colour that you want. Yeah. Right, that's a nice colour, right? You know what I mean. And then just, uh, oh, oh my god, on camera, Josh, shout at me, please. Yeah, just paint it up then, right? Okay, you can see it's taking paint quite nicely. Right, uh, you know what I mean? A lot of uh, firsts are done with this sculpting. Yeah, model sculpting. Uh, and we know that our, our Dave, Dave E3, yeah, he does all our models and uh, what I call it, uh, smaller stuff is all done via green stuff. Uh, and then maybe then just darken it up a little bit in areas and then lighten it up in certain areas around the edges uh, I know that Dave did a, a lovely uh, a cracking video yesterday of just simply dry brushing uh, you know what I mean something that he does I think it came out quite nice to be honest did it guys yeah. Amy, Amy and Josh were, were uh, heading that up they had they, it was like it, it was like a scene out of uh, the Avengers. Yeah, we had all the kit, every bit of kit that we got. They were playing big stuff, um, and and I that I was kicked out. They won't allow me in there. It worked because uh, okay. it's because you couldn't handle not being on camera. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not as professional as like, like, So there, there's a colour. Okay, yeah, it's done. Right, you know what I mean. It takes a paint. That's a Vallejo model paint. Right, you know what I mean. Any type of acrylic paint, it'll work on. Um, I haven't tried any other paint, but I'm pretty sure it'll work on everything. Right? You know what I mean? It's a modeler's putty, so it's good for filling in, uh, filling in gaps. Um, you know, what I mean? if you're building a uh, airplanes or tanks or something like that, it's ideal for filling in that, uh, that type of thing. Um, just looking at the time, so um, right, okay. So that's that. Uh, 
blah blah blah. Yeah, what well, Josh is having a bit of yeah, for Josh being promoted, did he get uh, did he get a pay raise with it? No chance. He's going up anyway. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone had a pay raise. They've had a pay raise, you know what I mean? So it's going up anyway, so blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, don't give the Josh ideas getting <laughs> about getting paid. He can make a decent coffee. Yes, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, he, he is the brew but ah oh, Josh. Yeah, Josh coffee last week, I will say, was lovely. It was drinkable, mate. It was, was it last week? Yeah, it was doing. Yeah, yeah, it was last week. It was drinkable. Dean is getting close to 11 as well, so my cup's going over. You can't see me what I'm doing here, so my cup's going over to there. So, yeah, so you can put, let me get rid of that because I like that desk for that. Josh is a good idea. That was yeah. Amy's the, the, the idea. That was that's brilliant. Yeah, J Dean, put the kettle on. Come on. You know what I mean? Your la the last cup of coffee you made was disgusting, so I expect better. Uh, but I'm going to keep. Where, where I painted that down colour, I'm going to paint, because that's sort of um, uh, fresh growth, maybe, you know I mean, that type of thing. So I'm going to keep it a brighter green. So again, we've got different tones and stuff like that. Might be wrong, uh, you know what I mean, but it is popping. It is looking like quite quite smart and stuff like that. Um, so I'm going to sort of, but I am going to dull it down with a bit of concrete dust. So I'm going to have a go at that now, right? So I'm going to have to go to number three, I think, Josh, and I'll put it on the, I'll put it on the floor. On the, on the side with it. All right, okay. Um, but I'm going to gently do this because I don't want to not ruin it, but put too much on. No, no wetting on you now, right? Just, just rubbing it on, right? And it will still sort of stay because if you wet it, it will then, oh, here he is. His Dean's in here. Like, you know what I mean? For this reason, if you wet it, right, it, you there's a lot more stays on. Right, and all I want is to is for it to go into the recesses and stay in there. And I gotta be gentle as well, because the uh, stuff is. <laughs> I gotta, don't give me puppy eyes, Dean. What's this about? I've got to pay rice. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, no, yeah. Don't want to call it the, the model. <laughs> Yeah, the morning coffee with Josh. Morning, yeah, we got we got the our very own, Amy is the is the coffee. You know, I mean, she 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 makes she's got she's got a million views on on what views on what TikTok. on t million views on TikTok, right? Because she made a cup of coffee blindfolded, right? And got a but she never made one, yeah. <laughs> not one, come on, about one cup of coffee, and that was it. You're not paying her. That's fine. <laughs> Ah, see now being rough. Okay, I'll just put that back in there. Okay. I, all I want to do is just give that dirty look on there. I think that's achieved that. What do you think of that? Good. That looks alright, doesn't it? That looks quite dirty ish, doesn't it? You know what I mean? Maybe maybe a little bit of light rust. No. Light earth. Light earth, Martin, light earth. So it is a different tone, a different sort of um got a three so I can two oh, sorry, one. Sorry, so I can explain. Um, there is a sort of different colour to what the brick is, to what the sort of the cliff face is. Um, but you'd see that you see dust pa patches, and you know, I mean, if the dust is being blown up, right, especially if it's like you know, I mean, a sandy desert or something like that, and it's not that colour or something like that, you'd have that dust colour coming in, uh, and where the roots and what colour, it would sort of trap it, and that's what I'm trying to do here. I'm trying to get that little area there. Just it's a fine detail, right? You know, I mean, something. Some people, most people will say, oh, what's the point? But again, coming down to the realistic, uh, what is the, one of the big YouTubers turned on to say, museum quality modeling or something like that, you know what I mean? So I'm trying to add that detail into that, I'm trying to say that the UK can do that as well, like, you know what I mean? So, um, I want a different, smaller, smaller brush. Can you pass me one of the tiny little, one of them brushes, I see it on the top up there on, the, on my paint station. Yeah, so you probably have to pull it out, uh, pull the door out first because it won't come out of the roof. Okay, so I just want to add some some of. Um, I don't even want to brush this, Josh. Hang on, oh, stop, 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 stop. Oh, okay. What a brush, he brings the whole lot. <laughs> That's how Josh. And drop something in the meantime. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, uh, so they still on about you and making coffee, Josh. <laughs> Start on the channel now. Yeah, yeah, they have said, you know what I mean? It's, it's the WWS mo uh, making coffee with Josh. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Hello, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's half a cup. Why is it half a cup? 
Look, Josh, get on. Look at that. Oh, I can't see it. Get on camera, you can see it. Oh, actually. What was that about pink lasers? <laughs> look. Half a cup. It's down there. Yeah, well, no mind. Anyway, lovely. Okay, go to uh, a camera that I'm working on. I'm modelling. It's going to be coffee. Coffee, coffee break. Uh, you can't see me. I don't t- get off me talking. You don't want to see me talking. They want to see me modelling. Go to two. A lot of bit better. Okay, so I mean, I've swapped my brush now to find a brush. Yeah, okay. I was using a big, a big fat brush like that. So you can see the other one now. That one there. Yeah, a little bit smaller. Right, okay. Uh, I'm using, uh, I like this because you're awesome. Look at this. I'm using camera, uh, camera two. <laughs> so I'm saying, I'm using uh, that's light earth, yeah, okay. So, um, light earth. Uh, there's a weather powder, light earth. Okay, just put on concrete dust, right? So I just want to lighten, uh, darken it down a bit now as well. So just a little bit of, a little bit of detail and stuff like that. Again, it, you know, I mean, it, it'll stick into the recesses and maybe only I can see what it's done and stuff like that or but it it, it, does, it will make a hell of a difference it does really make a difference to be honest you know what I mean um, put the weather and powders onto here it's made it more solid when we airbrushed it I think and, and Josh will agree with me on this when we airbrushed it it looked nice didn't it but it mm. just looked it with the colours right but it, it just didn't feel right it didn't it wasn't the, yeah the feeling or the look of it wasn't the texture wasn't the didn't texture look wasn't right didn't look right now that looks heavy the texture's there just by putting the powders on and putting them on dry yeah you know what I mean so supposedly the elements yeah 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 it's 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 weathered it. You know, ta-da! <laughs> there we are. We just come to it. We just sold it. <laughs> it's weathered it. <laughs> <coughs> okay. So just, just. I mean, I gotta be gentle because obviously, I've got some. Still got some wet ones. Uh, wet uh, or undried, or uncured. But I'm gonna go down now. Changing colours. I'm going to go down uh, the uh, watercolor. The, um, I keep saying watercolor. I do apologize. The the the, the vine. Yeah, no, not the vine. The root. Okay. I want to get see it in here. And where the weather and powder has sort of fallen off the brush onto the um, onto the ridges. Maybe you can see I'll try and bring it over. So yeah, there we are. You can see it. See you see that sort of dust catch for there? That's quite smart. I'm gonna try something, alright? We need to fix it there because it's not stay there, but I got layer and spray here, and I'll I'll layer and spray, right? You know what I mean? Like I said, it dries matte. Right, okay, and I mean it dries it doesn't dry sticky as well, right? It is an adhesive, but it doesn't dry sticky. So I'm just gonna gently I can't work on that now till that's dry, right? But hopefully that's fixed that there. Either that or I've just totally ruined the model. Please. <laughs> right, there's a gamble that we just taken, so we'll we'll see. We'll have a look. I'm hoping fingers crossed. I'm starting to watch it dry because it's quite warm in here as well. So I'm hoping we've just it's worked. So we'll soon see. So I'm going to go back down again on concrete dust. In the background, you can hear Josh eating. <laughs> okay, sorry if you can't see that angle, guys. Yeah, you should. Yeah, you can. It's lightening up a bit there, but it's too light for me in there now. So again, back down with the earth, light earth, just to dull it down a bit. Well, I'm happy with that. That looks pretty good, to be honest. Um, I'm gonna add a bit more earth to here. But I'm also gonna bring in light brush, just to. 
bring back that tone, that colours around the the rock. There we are. That's a bit better. Again, you might not be able to see it by what I'm doing, but you know, I mean, in the flesh, trust me, it's making a lot of difference. Twenty people in, guys, and thirteen likes. Thank you very much. Okay, I'm gonna still wait for that little bit, that that shiny bit that I've done by there to dry. It is starting to dry off that bit as well, and it hasn't affected it. Um, <laughs> I just don't want to spray anymore, just in case it doesn't do it. It should be alright. It should be alright. I have done things like this before and it has worked. I can remember which colours works because I'm it is drying up a bit. Hair drying now, see that's what you want. I mean I mean I normally uh maybe not finish yet. <laughs> so you finish then Sam yeah? I see all the people coming over to me now yeah, to see a real modeler. So it's <laughs> He's drunk it on the way. Yeah, it, I, Kelly, yes. And, and the taste of it as well. I, oh, yeah, I need to do. I think we should give up on, on Josh even making good coffee. <laughs> oh. Okay. Start, start in, uh, starting to look, what I call it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Busy day, dude. Have a good one. Thanks, Sam. Uh, I am finished with the wearing powder as well. Bring him in. I want to start. I want to try something, right? Because I've seen it on some on work. And guys, let me know if you think this is. Uh, uh, <laughs> let me know if you uh, if you think this is yeah, this is a good idea, right? Well, you, you see some like sort of whitish or or or. or I, I want to bring in now a desert yellow, right? That sort of that color, right? Just a streak. Maybe in there, do you think? And I mean, I'm asking you, you know, like the the the, you, the pot blush, uh, you know, what I mean, just sort of streaking in a little bit. Maybe I'd, I can always dull it back down if I need to with the what I call it. Oh, green green moss is something I'm going to bring into here as well. So that is drying. That's drying quite nice actually, and matte. Um, I still can't see the weather and powder stuck on there yet, but. I think I can start to see a bit by there. But what I'll do is maybe finish it off at the end. I don't know, I'll see. I'll see. So, yeah, you know, I mean, I don't know what I don't, you want to cut. No band done on there. I'm, I'm here yet now. <laughs> yeah. So, I'm going to do a little bit of green moss down here now, right? So, Josh, I can't see the bottom. Oh, I can do that. I can do that. Sure. Yeah. You might not be able to see it. No. Like, what, you, yeah, have a look. Have a look. Okay. I'm not going to do a lot. And again, I'm applying dry. Right. Okay. Not wet. And I'm only doing it down the bottom because that's where the moisture would be. Maybe go thick in there. I sort of picking my battles as well, picking what what the the area that I want. To moss it up. Now, Sam did say if he's probably gone. Yeah, green moss. Yeah, yeah. Sam did say that using the green moss with, I think it was the black soot, came out well. I can't remember because he did it on his one of his videos and it, it came out well. And again, because I mean, I have used these on certain ones, but you know what I mean? I can get the lid off. I'm gonna lid off with a, it's gonna go everywhere now with my track record today, right? It's not gonna end up looking like a coat like a work on it, like a minor. <laughs> so just a little bit. Uh 
yeah okay so it tones that green right down lovely yeah you know what I mean okay so we work it together now and then we work it up I mean, can you see it on there yeah yeah you can see it on there it seems that Josh has abandoned me and I've been given work to do no, I've got work to do Um, apply and dry the reason why it just I don't know I don't know why I just love it I just think it's much, it's it's more natural it looks more natural maybe if you're weathering a, a tank or weathering something like that then maybe you know I mean apply wet and what a cup of with it's dry with it's doing this stonework it doesn't sit on the top it actually goes into the rock and makes that lot more hell of a lot more better. I got concrete dust, I've got I've done concrete dust on them and I'm just trying to dirty this air this bottom up here a bit, bit more. Uh, I got on it. Um and, you know I mean our weathering powders, you know I mean double S weathering powders. Again th this was uh, something that I developed myself yeah uh, just to be honest what a big hit and, you know I mean everybody to be fair I got so many good good feedback from it that how, how, how they love it and it's easy to use and you know I mean it, it uh, and although that we call it concrete dust or moss or something like that and people are starting to use it for you know I mean Differently, and you know, for different things as well, and you know, we not and, and stonework is a lot that's been used on it. So I want to bring a different. Um, so this is our deep. Oh, so I'm using near enough the full range, but yeah. So deep rust, okay, yeah, lovely. That that's pretty much that colour anyway, right? And I mean, so because I want to sort of not lose that rust, that that readiness of the of the brick. Blend that. Then I'll just push. Oh, look at that. What do you think of that, guys? Let me know. No. Sort of mossy green. What do you think, guys? Yeah, looking yeah, good. Nice. Yeah. What do you like? What do you lot guys think on the on the live? Yeah. Let me know. If you don't like it, speak your mind. Speak now forever, only peace. <laughs> Let's tone it down a little bit more. Uh, bring in a bit of light rust. So this is light rust, so another colour. Yeah, I keep missing a shot. Okay. Again, I'm just building, building up texture, building up colours. Yeah, you know, I mean, the depth of it. Um, well, that's pretty much the colour of the the stone. It's a nice orangey colour. Ah, that's worked up lovely. So I'm then I'm going to highlight certain areas now in the higher area. Yeah, that looks wicked. Okay, so I'm going to do some work over here now. Somebody tell Layla that I'm live. <laughs> Josh, can you tell Layla that I'm live? Yeah, She's phoning me. Oh, actually, no, right. Yeah, yeah. She'd be, she'd work yeah. out. Now I'm going to shame her now because <laughs> she phoned me live when I was live. Okay, so just all I'm doing is just building up sort of the colours and toning down something that might be a little bit bit too much in your face 
uh, and it just keeps adding to the to the detail. Make sure that you can see what I'm doing. Okay, so I'll just leave that settled down. <laughs> yeah, she just texts now every time on Wednesday. She, she gets me every time. She keeps forgetting. That was, well, she is trying to run the company, so. Um, okay, so. I don't want to do any more up here because I think that's enough if you know what I mean I'm just gonna add a couple of I got a bit of a little bit of foliage just gentle a little bit of foliage to go on there and then we'll stick our, our flower on top of there and then we could be coming up towards done but not not yet you know what I mean so just add in just you know when once that's down on there and then you've got other stuff in front of it or you join it to another diorama it's gonna start a lot more getting on it so I just uh, add in a bit more So but I, I start with a green coat first. Uh, I no reason, just because I can and just because I am. Uh, so the layering spray, I can see. Uh, don't worry, she's texted to say that she's a. Uh, I, I, I caught her again. She's caught her again. I can see that. So some of it stuck on there, but I don't like it. So I'm not going to do it again. Yeah, I'm going to leave it as it is. Okay, so just sort of build up now the green. I got really heavy with there with that green and I don't like it. So let's get a big brush. Get rid of it. There we are, tone it down a bit. And if I do that I can then use that colour there to bring back the stone colour a bit more. There we are. That looks smart. I'm gonna go green under here though. Because I've got a bit of white they can see coming through. And then black. So, because this is a sort of an underneath, you want a darker colour under here anyway, so, you know, for a shadow. Maybe really rich. He's done a seam with that, that looks wicked. So I guess to blend it in now. Oh yes. Actually that I, if you could see that but there, that just looks the the bees. Okay, and then so put a green now just to bend it down. Right, okay, so there we go. Well, I gotta remember now what colours what. Light rust. Here we go. Green moss, that's an easy one. And uh, once I put these lids on now because I'm bound to chuck these over the place. Right, light earth, that goes up there. Black, so obviously that's an easy one. And then deep rust. Right, okay, so uh, that's that quickly done out the way. I'm gonna try a bit of desert yellow, right? Just to get that water color powder in. So that there it is. There, okay. There's the color there. I can't tip it up too much. Come on, I get the angle. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Um, and I'm going to try. I'm going to try and sort of seam it there, so you do get sort of like the white spill out or the yellow spill out. It's going to be tiny detail, right? But it might work. It might not. If it doesn't work, I'll just bring it back down to what I call it and see if you can see what I'm doing. Without a little brush. Yeah, it's got that little lightness for you. It might not work, to be honest, guys, and I might just sack it. I don't think it is. No. No. Didn't work. Had a try. Didn't work. Didn't like it. Move on. Okay. Right. Okay. So, right. Right, yeah, let me show you what I've done. Okay, so, yeah, we got sort of that green weather and that sort of that at the base of a, of a thing. I just see there's a big blob of green in there that can get rid of. Just, just a different colour on the bottom, just to add a little bit more detail to it, yeah, you know what I mean? Which then gives you, um, if I can ask Amy to come up and start doing the full view for us now, right? So, but that, so you can see there that that texture has come up. You know what I mean? That, that we've added that texture at the bottom. So when you do that one, I need widening up. Yeah, no, wait, okay, so I'm talking about it, so you can't see Amy's arm. <laughs> okay, bear with us. Yeah, well, okay, yeah, you can see sort of, you know what I mean? That, that, that I got that gr darker area there and then coming up and then this area has worked up quite quite a treat, to be honest. And quite honestly, I didn't need really need to paint the, the, that coming down. Yeah, all I needed to do was was the weathering powder. Okay, so that's come up quite smart actually. I like that. Yeah, there it is. I need, might need there's some white spots in there. I might need to get rid of. But anyway, so what we need to know is add some foliage now to the tree just to make it a little bit greener, right? Okay, um, a, a simple process. This is. I think we might need to go to three. Try three. No, let's go to go to two. Well, we we'll go to two. We can just barely see that on top of that. So I am going to spray. Um, to, but I'm going to spray sort of because I don't want to get the layer of spray hopefully onto the thing I just and it's only going to be the sort of the tips that I want to do uh, again if it goes on don't panic you know what I mean it, again uh, this it, it was been it was on there and it's dried out quite nice you know what I mean and and a matte so okay that's all we need right and I want I'm going to use our olive green. Yeah, available soon. Not quite yet. Uh, and this is just literally sprinkle on. Right, it's an added detail. Right, like, you know what I mean. Again, it. I'm. I'm doing it fine. I don't want a load on it. I might have to put a little bit of dark green in there just to. Oh God, actually, that's come out quite nice. And there's some, there's a little bit of layering spray with it. Oh, right, okay. I put a little bit of layering spray just just on there. And the foliage, so that's something, right, okay, let me show you something different. Let me show you something different. Okay, so a little bit of layering spray on the bottom, so a quick squirt, right? Right, and now, now then, in, in there, the, this is our, our algae. Let me have a look at this. So this is algae, yeah, okay. Right, I think that is available, right? Again, less is more. Finer detail now, right? But if it's damp, it'll grow. We might, you know, I, mean, I might be totally wrong here, right? And you might say, oh, you want to have that in the desert or in that red rock or something like that. But yeah, I think that's wicked. It just adds a little bit of texture to it again, so you know, I mean, a little di different type of texture to it. Yeah, Amy? Mm. Yeah. That's good. Okay, cool. Um, that's all I want to put on that one, so I'm going to need to spray this a little bit more up here. Uh, but now that I've done that little bit, there's a tiny little bit just, just left there, and it looks wicked. 
I, I'm not worried about the, the layer of spray going on to the model and, and then obviously the foliage then sticking to the model. Again, once it's dry, you can brush it off anyway, right? But, you know what I mean? I just want to make the, the, the sea foam to me is just a little bit too delicate. So I needed to make it look a little bit more fuller, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I know. I'm pushy about that. Do you want to go there? Yeah, yeah I, I don't know. If they can see it. If not, change it. Okay, well, I've gone really heavy down by here, so I'm going to wait with the layer and spray working on. I can show you then. How are we gonna br are we brush it off right now? Thank you, Cat. Okay, so a little different texture now, right? Different, sorry, different color. Uh, there, yeah, there. Okay, there's bright green. It's not as bright as it looks like on the thing. So some more layer and spray again. Just tiny little bits, and I don't want a lot of this, right? Because it is quite contrast. I just want to sort of on the tips, maybe where the sun will go on it a lot more. Yeah, that's just literally done a little thing, and maybe a little bit of algae just to brighten up a bit more. So there's the tree that is pretty much done, right? Uh, you can see there's a lot of uh, foliage on the back of the, well, I, don't worry about that, I can brush that off, I just want to show you the tree a minute. Yeah, so there's a the foliage on the tree. So it's just sort of transformed that tree and it's just delicate enough. That's all we wanted and there's the root system. Yeah, you know I mean, going down and you can see the roots going into there and then obviously we follow the roots down to that bottom pit then where we did there, change the colour on that. Cool, well we're going to leave that dry, so have a quick slurp of your coffee. Right, we'll leave that dry and then I'm going to sort of brush it off. I don't want to brush it off now because it will, it'll, you know, in the brush, uh, we'll pick up the layer and spray and then it'll stick to all the brush and it won't get it off. So we're going to leave that dry a little bit now, so. Um, and then what I can do once I've had my coffee, what we'll do then is work on um, work on a bit the, of the, the um, orchid, okay? So, hmm. and then we're almost done. Yeah, we'll do a little short one on that one, but uh, I'm going to show you, give you a sort of a scene at the end then as well. So it's a little uh, a little little treat of a scene coming out. Uh, and then you can see, uh, you know, we can, you can see what we're going to use it for, or, or, or it'll give you an idea then of what maybe that you can sort of sink it into, into something that you're doing. I mean, I've got it on a big block like that, and I mean, I could cut literally cut it down there, yeah, and then you could just stick that into a in, into a in, into a face, yeah, you know what I mean. So, but it's 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 coming on quite nice. You know what I mean? I'm pretty sure that Felix is, uh, is on. I'm, I'm pretty sure, mate, that you're quite happy with this. Yeah, you know what I mean? Because uh, I'm pretty sure you see lots of this around here, so. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, so. Yeah. Okay, give me on camera one for a minute while we're waiting on dry. Right? So I can have a quick chat. Right, we have just hit over 4,000 hours on YouTube, so that means that we can start, hopefully, putting some merch on. Yeah, you know what I mean? And uh, getting some of Martin's famous t-shirts. Yeah, nice white one and the green one. That's all we're having is white and green, right? Because <laughs> no, they, everybody hates it. Everybody says, oh, that green one's disgusting. It's not, it's not green, it's lovely. <laughs> it's not, it's not green, <laughs> I'm lying. Uh, but um, we got, you know what I mean, Josh, to be fair, I'm pretty sure, yeah, well, don't don't put too much pressure on my orchid, right? It's, you might not see it because it's going to have to be delicate, really delicate, right? You know what I mean? And all it is is a sea foam with a bit of white, but it should should 
break it up a bit. I mean, we might put one or two on a on an overhang because they grow on overhang, then they grow sort of. I say orchid. Yeah, no, they do. They do grow. I got a couple of orchids in the house. Uh, T-shirts. Yeah, I love the green one. See, Carly loves the green one, guys. Yeah, so you're wrong. All you lot are wrong. I'm right, and Carly's right. Well done, Cal. Um, so yeah, I'm just sort of waiting for this to dry. Once it's dry, I can brush it off. Then right? I'll keep blowing every now and get it done. I said, Josh, blow this. So, <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, yeah, but Josh will start designing some of our t-shirts, I'm pretty sure, you know what I mean? Uh, will Josh model the shirts? <laughs> yes, we'll get Josh and Amy to model the shirts. We'll have a fashion show. You know I mean? I've got a catwalk we can do, you know what I mean? We'll get Dean to design a catwalk. Dean, design a catwalk. <laughs> miniature one, and we'll put them on miniature. <laughs> um, so yeah, well, you know what I mean? We, we'll have a look. We'll have maybe some cups and some, you know what I mean, some badges. and I don't know yet, you know what I mean? If, if, if it's cry for it, we'll do it. Yeah, we, we'll do it. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying to, I'm looking at, oh, there's some of our resin pieces. Forgot we had these. Oh, there's a fire hydrant there, isn't it? An American fire hydrant. Double O gauge, I think, or O gauge, that is. It's a double O gauge cone that I painted. You can't see them. See, they're useless now. They work and they can't do it. There's a sign. There's a gate. No, that's a pallet. Resin pad. Post box. Post box, anyway. Can you see that? Wait, you can't see that. There's our uh, cone that I painted. 3D resin printed. Can you see it? Can I? Maybe it's sort of squinting. Mm, yeah. yeah, well, well. They, they're coming out soon, shortly. Skip. That way. There's a skip I painted. Anyway, that, that I'm just chewing the fat, like I said. Um, so yeah, so you know, I mean, watch this space. We'll we'll see if we can get some caps. Yeah, oh, I, oh, I've looked into caps. Yeah, I'd love to have a WWS cap. You know what I mean? Or modeling with Martin, that'll be good. Modeling with Martin, or a T-shirt modeling with Martin, with me like that. Nice grey polo shirt, be smart. Yeah, well, my grey polo shirt. This is a war This is what I got for Wally. This is me. So, um, uh, Andy, what have you got on this afternoon? Have you got anybody coming on this afternoon? Mate? Shout out. Yeah, give a good big shout out for that one. Like, and and another two boys then that, that that helped me on the Facebook. Group. Oh, right. Okay, yeah. Two boys that helped me on the Facebook group. Northern Rails forty four. I said it straight away. Look, and Peaks forty seven. Yeah, Craig. Craig Shaw, Sam Jones. Yeah, you've seen us on live a couple of times. Uh, um, I think that's going to be something a monthly we doing. Uh, we're going to get hopefully get some guys coming on as well. You know, we do have a chit chat with us in the evenings. Um, next Tuesday, I don't hold me to this right because Sam will shout at me if I get it wrong. But I think we might be live announcing as well. So um, you know, what I mean the competition. As long as it's khaki green snapback, I'll buy it. <laughs> khaki snapback. I'm a spanner t-shirt <laughs> I'm a well, that's a cracker I'm a spanner t-shirt I told you about the uh, spanner that I got that's in the Liberty Stadium in Swansea that is now I know that is and anyway big spanner I got me and Dean made um, on the laser cutters is it? Uh, yeah I do know that I didn't know that no way yeah we I was on rugby tour when I was on rugby I used to go rugby tour I was we had kangaroo court and I was a judge <laughs> Uh, so we had the spanner of the day and we had to carry the spanner around with him and it was a big spanner, it was like a huge, but like that it was. Um, and in the end, then one of the one of the dads was a groundsman and he went in uh, in in um, the Liberty and it's in his office in the in the Liberty Stadium. So there we go. We've got Martin Demers, a club. Uh, Martin Demers, a club member, Homeby Life Steam and double an old gauge partner. Excellent, they were tune into Andy, yeah, right, okay. Right. Uh, you know, <laughs> I can't be. I can't. I'm a spanner. Is cracker. I love that. <laughs> yeah, I absolutely love that. That's brilliant. I'm a spanner T-shirt. <laughs> um, yeah. So, uh, so, so, competition. How's it all going, guys? Yeah, you you can have a nice little whinge at us now, saying that it's taken over for, for the last month and a half. Yeah, you know, I mean, I stopped you modeling on your layout, and I you mean, know, you're obsessed. Can you do me to order a t-shirt? I'm 
Not free on Wednesdays. <laughs> not free on Wednesdays. I say, yeah. Modley with Martin takes over on Wednesdays. <laughs> Leave me alone. Um, you know, in the competition. Oh, right, my, my, there's some entries coming already, and whoa, I tell you something, the standards is. Ooh, it's going to be a long, long weekend. I think I'm going to have to get a few boxes of wine in a meet, and I mean, the three of us are going to have to sort of um, uh, sit down and uh, and video call, Zoom meeting. You know what I mean? Have a Zoom meeting and and uh, and uh, and decide how the cotton picking out. Are we going to decide on the winner? Like, and I mean, it's going to be really, really tough. Uh, modern the standard of modern is phenomenal. Like, and and if people keep joining. Yeah, you know, what I mean, I think we're gonna have a, we'll have to have a break. Um, we're gonna have to have a break after this, yeah. You know, I mean, uh, to, for you guys to recover and get on with some modern. Plus, it's summertime coming as well. We, you know, I mean, we're hoping that we're gonna have a lovely summer. I'm having a um, still look, look on my normal YouTube, not my not on the group. I won't put on a group, right? But on, on my it's not a YouTube, my uh, normal Facebook group, right? Not the group, just my normal Facebook. Me, right? Or for my updates of my building, I'm having a ki outdoor kitchen mid. ready for the summer. I can't wait. You start in either Saturday or Monday. I can't wait. It's gonna be great, you know. I mean, I can't barbecue, I can't cook, <laughs> but uh, you know, I mean, I'll, I'll I'll buy it all in and then pretend, you know. I mean, just stick a put a fire pit. I got a fire pit going in, but no, I, I'm enjoying it. When I, I when I was off a couple of weeks ago, uh, you know, I mean, when I was like just sort of incapacitated, couldn't do anything, to just about lift the TV remote. I watched a lot of barbecuing on YouTube on the on the TV, and it's giving me a crack an idea. Uh, I've got a few things left to do tomorrow on my diorama then I'm done excellent Clive you'll be uh, you have to include a t-shirt uh, in the competition prize <laughs> whoa we, yeah we could do that I, we haven't got, we, we're not going to have time now on this one but yeah we could give away a couple of t-shirts yeah, can we do another competition with t-shirts barbecue at yours and we will be uh, and, uh, and we will be cooking hey, Andy you're more than welcome come down mate we know that you know, we, 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 we're good mates now we're not, you know I mean it's a uh, um, you know, you're always a, a welcome at my place. Anybody, yeah. I live in. I live. Uh, I do. Anybody can come down. My address is <laughs> Buckingham Palace, <laughs> London. S A. Is it S A? No, S A S S one in it. Something like that. That's where I live. Right. So, <laughs> knock a door. Come on in. <laughs> Sit in the background. I'm just looking at what I call it. Um, yeah. You know. I mean. So. I come down and I'll cook. You're probably an expert, Brian. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's just we just can't afford to get there. That's the problem. I mean, just oh, this is starting to dry a little bit more now. We can. That's one corner there, so I'll start brushing it off. Uh, ah, that's coming off lovely. Oh, I'll, I'll then blow it off. And somewhere I want to stay there anyway, right? So I mean, oh, a little bit more. But yeah, the competition is phenomenal. There's some really, really top. Well, the the you're all top, top one. The SW one, I did. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, I was never, I was never stationed anywhere near that. No, 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 no BS for me. I was a uh, proper soldier. Me, <laughs> I got muddy more than uh, than shiny. Uh, so yeah, I um, I I am blown away by it. Like, I mean, I, and what whatever rules, oh your old sweatshirt T-shirt, well this time, <laughs> yeah. I, I, I got my white t-shirt I keep looking into it I keep white in uh, yeah, so you, you google that Kelly you know, you just google that I know you did <laughs> uh, yeah I got my white t-shirt out ready to wear today and uh, where, this, where the paint spattered all over it it's uh, it's got a big spat of paint there like that. Like, oh, there's a painting t-shirt now so <laughs> but I'll, uh, uh, Monica, we'll, we'll get that going we haven't looked into it to be honest you know what I mean it's not something that we're not that's your that's your boss, yeah, yeah. Um, you know, we haven't looked into it yet, so we we will do. We will look into it and see what we can do. You know what I mean? Um, right. Let me see. It is still a bit wet. Hmm. I tell you what I do then. We make the pockets. Oh, these this so just to show you. Yeah, these are different types of. Uh, let me move that out of the way. So that's a Swansea Council food bag, <laughs> just so just in case you're interested, right? Um, and then I sort of, sort of, when 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 the missus, when calf wasn't looking, I sort of snapped these off the apple tree. I, I eat, I don't want not the apple tree, the pear tree. I don't want the pear tree. It's it's going to be way in my kitchen, so in my outdoor kitchen. 
So <laughs> I'm trying to get rid of it slowly. Uh, somebody said cop a nail, but it takes ages. So you know, what I mean, that's a good, good little thing that you can, you know, what I mean, put on a on a diorama just like that. Oh, I can't see it. Just some sort of flat like that or something like that. So that's a nice little piece. Um, why can't they see the base, guys? They can't see the base. Whatever, well, that's fine. They can't see the base. No, mind, don't worry. I'll pick it up. No, I'll pick it up. That's fine. Yeah, there's, you know, what I mean, little twigs like this, straight twigs I got. You know, what I mean, uh, that's a nice straight one with a with branches coming off. I just sort of picked the selection of it, and I mean that's that could be a good uh, uh, root, you know what I mean, coming out. So maybe that's something that type of thing. And then all you do then is glue uh, C foam bits onto it. Um, you pick a selection of C foam, you know what I mean, a, a good bunch or something like that. And then you select, you just, you know what I mean, maybe that's a top. That's a good top. Yeah, uh, you know what I mean, and you just sort of glue that on top of the gut, you know what I mean, so I do that under that, you know what I mean, bosh, there we are, and then you just sort of, I super glue it as usual, and then just dress it off, and I kept this one, yeah, very, just small little branches, because I, I wanted it bare, but I also wanted it to make sure that it looked, um, you know what I mean, looked like a tree as well, like, you know what I mean, so... Okay, so okay, so put them away. And then my nice little cupboard. Oh, and I wanted a sorry, one of them. Okay, so I'm, this is where I'm going to need my glasses because this is fine detail. Well done, Dean. Next time, stir it because that's where all the sugar was. <laughs> right, so uh, we're going to select. I don't want. I'm going to select one. I'm going to try and get rid of as much of the seeds as we can, right? So I'll just sort of pull it through. Because they sort of stick out, stand out, and I don't want the seeds in them. And we only need, really need, we're only going to need a fine little bit. Okay, so, um, right, can you swap cameras then, guys, please? Camera free, probably, is probably the best one to go on this one. I, I'll, I'll wait for him to change because he's got to get off his butt. <laughs> no, okay, lovely. Right, let me zoom in. You don't like it with me after work, do you? Yeah, well, they've got to do some work, you know what I mean? It's childish, that is. Okay, and all I'm doing now is slicing off the small bit. Yeah, I really only want, uh, that's probably not right. I'm trying to look for the smallest but bushiest, if you know what I mean. We don't want to make it look like a tall plant. I got some debris here as well that I can uh, I'm gonna use. Maybe some you know I mean flicking around somewhere. Oh there are there's a good one by So if I get rid of the seeds in this one gently, just all I'm doing now, right, is getting rid of the seeds is just gently using my my, my finger, my thumb. Uh, and just picking them off, and then we're just going to look for. The, there's a good one bigger. Okay, right, and then splice it off. Don't lose it. And then again, I want to splice it off. So I'm going to make it tall first, and then I can chop it down when I want to. To what I want to. Yeah, yeah. you look. You talk in. Can you see that? That's, look how small that is. Yeah, that's how fine we go in. I can't get the camera in. That's how fine we go in, right? Okay, it's gonna be tiny. Um, but I also need to, because I know that I've got to chop that bit off there. Chop that bit off there, so I've got a little bit of something to hold on to. And I want that to grip. So it's in there. Yeah, we just about to see it. Right, this might not work. It might be pants. It might look to work on it. Right, I'm just trying something. So, right, so um, just lay this way the top. Right, and then I'm going to use our white. So this is our white. 
spun scatter. Yeah, a foliage, a white oh, sorry. A white foliage. Okay. And then I'm gonna just sprinkle on top. Because some orchids are white. Okay, so we get that. That type of thing. So I mean going against that red, I think that white the contrast of that white against that red is gonna actually it does really look smart to be honest. I have to admit. Um, so there's one. I mean I'm not gonna stick I'm only gonna stick one or two on there. I don't want to stick a lot on there. Uh, like I said, I got these this debris. This so this these are sort of been taken off. They look like the leaves from the sea foam. Okay, they're a bit big, but I can chop them down. But there's a lot of detail there that we can sort of, you know, I mean, foliage that I can stick in. And uh, you can't see it now. I will. I'll, I'll get a, a shot in there. I got the guys to, to move the cameras now. But I'll cut them up because they natural at the end of the day, and we'll just stick them on the the, the model just so you can see. Um, uh, see the bits and pieces that we're doing. Okay, right. One thing on them, one arm, one leg. Keep moving. <laughs> yeah, it did as it happened. <laughs> you get here. <laughs> um, just catch it up. Hello mate, Scott, mate, nice to uh, what do you call it mate, nice for you to come in. Uh, how does Scott mate become Scott? Scott mate, sorry. Not even the word, yeah. <laughs> I know, it's, it's sometimes the auto-correction sometimes, uh, that's what I blame. It's not my sausage fingers, make the auto-correction is a pain, so. <laughs> so, uh, Scott mate, mate, I'm on that. Yeah, so, um, oh, let me zoom out. I'm, I'm doing a fine detail at the moment, so that's why I zoomed in. But that's what I got at the moment, mate. Right? Yeah, okay. Um, I, I got some better shots, but the, the guys are busy with it working at the moment, right? But, you know what I mean, there's, there's the tree and the root system that I've done. Yeah, you can just barely see it, and which then goes down, down to there. And then, obviously, I've got a little bit of detail on the bottom down with that so far. Um, I'm just waiting for um, some of the stuff to dry so I can get rid of some of it because I've just gone too heavy. Where, where I put the foliage on with the layer of spray, it's gone a bit too heavy and I want to get rid of it. But also, I don't want to take a load off it because it's still, you know, I mean, it, it, it makes it look. Cool. It adds to the texture and to the look and stuff like that. It's starting to look really nice, to be honest. Nice and relaxed one today, guys, isn't it? Nice and relaxed. It's not like email an hour. It's I like in this one. It's chilled. <laughs> so I just sort of taken off all the foliage that was on the back of there. Yeah, just by you know, I mean, quick, quick brush and stuff like that. End your workout. Okay. I just done 14 minutes of workout. I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I need to sort of drop that off onto a, onto a board. Right, okay, I'm going to zoom back in again now, right? Um, i to bring that across because I want to stick it there as long as you can see it. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, tweezers again. Turn it around. So there's the flower that I'm sticking down. There's sort of like the orchid type thing I'm doing it. Uh, the only reason I'm calling it an orchid, right, because obviously that tend to grow some orchids, I, I believe, tend to grow. Josh, am I right in saying? You know what I mean? Seem to grow on, on on some rocky areas and stuff like that. I know that the orchids that I've got in the house, in the house, in the house, that's the Welsh view, is you know what I mean? They they don't like a lot of earth. It's just sort of woody type things and stuff like that that they want. Um, you know what I mean? Um, uh, and then the root sort of grows around. So I could, suppose you could do the root again with the with the uh, green stuff I done, but I'm not going to fuss around with that because it's that just taking me too guys. <laughs> so a bit of super glue I need to dip in, uh, uh, which is where I'm at. There it is. 
Yeah. Pop a super glue on there, right? Stick it into there and then pray. And then all we're gonna do is stick it right on the edge there. Okay, and then I'm gonna quick distance spray it here, but now <coughs> quickly move it up into position. Okay, so Josh, I know Amy, I need one of you here, just so you can see this detail, so we can sort of show everybody this detail. Actually, wow. Oh, well. Yeah, okay, so oh, well. there, right? That, so, so we've got a tool, Josh, we can sort of try and get it in there. Right, so if you look at it, that straight away sort of changes the dynamics of the, of the thing. Yeah, it makes it look you know what I mean, that one white flower, yeah, sort of, yeah, are we getting it? Josh is coming in. Yeah. Hello, Arla. Okay. And we get some, we get some cool photos of this now, and like, I'm, I'm pretty sure the guys are really, cool. oh, too soon, too much. Too soon. Yeah, okay. Um, you know I mean? It gives it such a work out. gives it such a work out. If I do that, you can maybe just, just pick it out onto that. You, that fine detail. Again, you, you, I mean, to, to be fair, the, the, the video cameras are not doing justice. I know I know Amy and Josh are going to sort of be all over this later on. I, I, they're going to play with a, what is it called? I don't know what it's called. It's a tracking camera or something like that. You know I mean? So you have some cool angles on it and stuff. Right? So, you know what I mean? Yeah, so there, so there it is. If I can get that, oh god. Yeah. Yeah, thanks, Scott. I mean, yeah, you know what I mean. Them clips are. Hang on, uh, the, them clips are you using to hold your flower? Uh, there you see, you can make them with the cell. Yeah, no, they sort of dab a glue, and we got the. Um, you can make it yourself, to be honest, like. But actually, that's a kit that like, we can make. Because uh, we've got abundance of these, of these, uh, that's just sort of a, a plinth and, and I've just super glue on the, into onto the top of it. It's very crude. I suppose we could. Yeah, people, we should do it. We should sell them. All right, let's make another one then. Okay. Um, oh, have I got what we got here? Should we do a different colour? Should we do a pink? Is there, is there a pink orchid? Yeah, we could. Oh, I just like there's, there's a question coming. Andy comes in, I, but I, I want it dry. Andy, you know, I mean, I, I, I know what you're saying, but with well, this one, I want a sort of a dry uh, sort of look in a, a landscape. Yeah, you're right, you would have that sort of slime. That's something we need to look at. And a slime, slime, you know, you know what uh, I'm talking to you two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, so I need to look into that. Shut up, Andy, for God's sake, you're giving me more ideas. You need some slimy green. Oh, you read that one. Yeah, okay. Wow, that looks something very special. Thank you. Yeah, something different. Yeah, it's totally different. Something that we've never, you know what I mean? So I'm just trying to. This is a um, fine scale type thing that I like to do. It's fiddly, but it does dramatically change. We're looking at so I'm now working on so Josh you need a camera angle to change please. You know me. I know that we're working like you've still got a job to do. Yeah, so there's what I've got a tiny bit of things like that. Okay, right. Um, leave it on that. Um, we'll change maybe colour maybe. I don't know if this is fine enough. So well, maybe fine enough. Okay, I'll just put it, no, I'm gonna stick the white. Stick the white, Martin, stick the white. Because uh, I like it, that white against that, against that, what I call it. If I, if I do it again, I'd make it smaller, because that's sort of sticking out too much. But I might stick one down by here, yeah, um, down by there, by the root system. Just by there, I think that, that will really then make that tree pop out a bit more and maybe I'm gonna stick a highlight on this tree for you as well to pull out the thing yes actually let me do that first 
Right, okay. So using um, desert yellow, okay, 7099, sorry, 70977, right, model color. Okay, right, I'm going to bring out the tree a little bit. So I'm going to highlight the tree a bit. So dry brush, so a little bit of paint onto there. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I'll use this one. You want to brush it off, brush it in first, and then brush it off. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, and then uh, so you guys can see what I'm doing. Yeah, and I'm going to start highlighting just the raised areas of it. Yeah, it's picking up. It's picking up. Maybe a bit more. That makes a real difference. Because you can see the so like the bark outline now as well, that's a that's a good thing because it highlights that all I'm doing is highlighting the raised areas. Again, you guys you knows uh, I mean you knows. Come I'm awful well she did eh? You you know the uh, the secret of uh, dry brushing it. You know what I mean. It's just to, on the raised areas to highlight it up. Like you just you know what I mean. You might not see the difference, but I can. Again, you know what I mean. And, and the guys will pick that up on hopefully on on the uh, photos later on. Okay, so now that I've lost my little orchid, there's a tiny, really one, but a re really tiny one. I can't see. Oh yeah, right. Here's one. I'm gonna have to do this though. Right, I don't think you can just. No, it's not even there, that's why. <laughs> I just dropped it. I need to put it over here so I can see the stem where I'm gonna put it on. It's jumping around. Just about got it. It's tiny. Yeah, I can just barely see it. I, I don't know where it's going to work. It's probably going to blow away now as soon as I get layer spray. So layer spray, uh, and then a bit of white stuff. Um, how the cotton picking on? I'm going to put the glue on there. I don't know. So you have to do this. So all I'm doing now is sort of pasting a bit of super glue, tiny bit of super glue, onto an area. I'll show you in a minute. I'm going to have to drop it into the glue because it's tiny and then move it around. There well, she's up right. Again, I want the height. I'm going to quickly spray that. I want the height up because yeah, it's just just a little one, just for there. Yeah, maybe we can call this awk awkward, <laughs> awkward park. <laughs> Anybody in Wales will know what awkward park is. Um, just trying to find another one, another small one that we can use. With my little bits and pieces. I did another cracking one, but it's gone west. Just trying to find a nice bushy. Bushy one that we can use. Actually, that's what I so doing that, just brushing it gently through the tweezers, gets rid of the 
There's one there. Look. Gets rid of their um, seeds. Quite nice. Okay, so okay, just got enough there now to put the uh, super glue on. Bit of white. Put a super glue and I'm going to stick it right on this edge bit if it'll let me, which is not going to. Hmm. Keeping you up, Josh. See you again. Keeping you up. <laughs> it's because it's boiling in boiling here. Boiling in it, yeah. <laughs> Amy's probably sitting there thinking, oh, this is toasty. Yeah, can she run it? The first time I've ever worn a t shirt in it. It's too hot. Come on. Okay, so quick squirt. Oh, no, not the layer spray. Quick squirt of the activator in the right spot and then make sure you bring it forward before it dries. Yes, got it. And there we go. So that's that bit done. So we got three flowers up on it. Okay. Uh, nice tiny little one in there right just to show you okay Josh I need a camera angle I need something can you see that then Josh do work, work, work his man no three is punts so do on, doing that one yeah and then coming in there right okay so you don't want to see like my head face right so there it is right um, there's the three flowers that we got going as well, right? Yeah, we, we're going to zoom in on this one now, Cal, and see if we can work on it. No, well. So that white flower against that red, I think looks well look good. <laughs> I might talk too quick, tonight. Uh, I did my... It's slippy. Uh, I'm just reading some comments, guys, why Josh sort of does uh, a, a thing around there. I'll keep going because I'm still what I call it. My voice, uh, truth be told, you can't, uh, you can't over whilst cracking with you, fair play. Thanks, mate. Thanks, Rob. Thank you very much. Uh, my wife said that when I, mean, I came off watching your lives, my Welsh accent gets very strong and she can't understand me less than that. 18 watching, 18 likes, great stuff. Yeah, brilliant, thanks. I mean, 18, 19 watching. Yeah, we've got a good um, a good crowd in today. So thank you very much. I love that. Um, Bright, yeah, everybody understands. It struggles listening uh, to me sometimes because I babble too much. Okay, so we'll get some really good little video clips of this, you know what I mean? And some, uh, maybe, you know what I mean? And some uh, good photos. I haven't finished yet. I've got a couple of more bits to do. Um, and then we'll wrap it up because I need to get out of here because it's too hot. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? Um, but you can see that you just that detail, you know what I mean? How, how the quality that you can get just by, you know, and it's, it's just airbrushing, yeah, dry brushing, uh, and then adding the, the, the delicate detail then, you know, coming into it. So the only other things I'm going to sort of, sort of do, I'm going to, like I said, I, I'm going to maybe have a look at maybe some dead stuff down here maybe down there I don't know yet I ain't got a clue I might I'll, I'll dress it up if I don't like it it ain't going on there yeah we maybe something that we push on the front of it as a tumbleweed or something uh, and these bits by here that I want to just sort of might if I don't if I like them add them up here and just have a look I'm gonna just uh, with them. Josh is coming into camera, camera two for me. 
Um, you can come in a bit moment so I can. Yeah, I got detail going in there now, so. Yeah, come in a bit more. Okay, cool. As long as it focuses it in. Yeah, okay. So all I'm doing is just little bits of, uh, like I said, the, the leaf, if I can get in there. The leaf of the you can't see it. Like the yeah, focus. Yeah, the the leaf from the the, the um, sea foam, and I'm just gonna glue. So I've got a bit of super glue here. I'm just gonna gently glue on bits as debris. If you know what I mean. Yeah, leaf debris. If it's too big, just chop it down. It's quite it's dry, so it's quite brittle. You know what I mean. But it does add the detail. If you know what I mean. Uh, leaf debris, is it maybe? Maybe in there. Have a good shot. Uh, we can maybe take something down like that. Oh, there's a little one. Okay, like that. You want to sort of coat on? No, oh, that's lovely. Great. Okay, I'm just gonna make sure rubberized horsehair is an awesome for general overgrowth and brambles definitely worth considering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I did right in the beginning. You saw me doing something uh, with them. Okay, I'm trying to get the pointy ones, the uh, uh, pointy leaves, just to add some sort of debris that we got, so it's fallen down. And it's, it's natural as well, so it looks looks quite smart. And again, it's just using utilizing what we've got, uh, what comes with the with the sea foam. Yeah, it's going to be quite a lot of debris coat over there, so we put some more over there. Maybe one hanging. Okay, that's going to be caught cool there. So one in there, could be going to catch in there. That's a nice point you want. So <coughs> that's a bit too big. So just, you know what I mean, it's just finer detail. adding just sort of sort of just fiddling around now with some more detail um, I looked on you I can see some some on you so that's what you're looking for I, I come in this little them little bits there that's on the sea foam okay yeah there's this there's, there's a load on the bottom over there I'm trying to get the zoom get a, get a shot you have to move it a bit further back yeah no yeah. Well, there's some little bits for there that we're looking for right in the middle and then we can chop them up or Hide them somewhere. Just got a little bit of super glue so we can just sort of stick it in. Randomly placed. Okay. Yeah, so pretty much maybe. Maybe I don't know I tell you what we'll do with a dead orchid. So no flower on it at all. 
down the bottom. So this is sea foam that we've had for a what, couple of seasons, which is uh, discolored. Oh, that's a cracking over there. Yeah, put that up there. And then well, you can see that colour there. Again, photos by the guys will happen. I think, gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, apart from fiddling with it too much, again, because you couldn't do too much to it. What do you guys think? Yeah, what do you think? Um, Josh, we need some sort of. I'm yeah, coming towards the ends now, do so. Yeah, yeah, oh, Amy, Amy's coming in. We're coming towards the end now, so, you know I mean? We need some, some work. I, I, you, you pick, you tell me. Okay, so there is, there's a shot there that we got. Okay, I pretty much think that's done. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to do too much more. We'll get, I'll get the guys to do, a, um, you know I mean, the, the shots of the stuff that you might not be able to see quite clearly. Yeah, you know, but you can see them, them orchids, they look stunning. Yeah, you know, bright outside the, um, what do you call it, right? The outside yeah. thing. So, yeah, thanks, Carl. You know what I mean? This is showing off my modeling skills, you know what I mean? So, some, I've enjoyed this one because it's something, what do you call it? <laughs> bloody lovely, yeah, bloody lovely in the best way to it. I've totally enjoyed it, right? You know what I mean? So, um, Amy's on the camera now so it's just it's gonna be yeah you can see the detail in there now that I've got yeah it's going up uh, it's a little just a little bit of small fine detail you're not gonna get a lot because it's getting blown off yeah any more would over egg it I think yeah it would it's just just you know I mean we just want that subtleness right um so I, I'm gonna build a scene up for you now right so uh, and and the models that I'm gonna show you right is um something that I've well, I'm gonna stand up yeah, just to show you, right? You know what I mean. So these are um, this is our saloon. So this is twenty eight mil, okay, right? But this is our saloon. General store. General store. I do do apologise. So Amy need to get in, get into shots with us now, right? Okay, and then um, yeah, it's not gonna work. I'm trying to think which one. Probably that's the best way. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'll come across this way, right? Okay, so. And then that that's e makes it easier then for me to place my place the bodies. Okay, uh, and these are uh, some we've got General Custers, one of them I think, and what do I call it? So we've got these here, Billy the Kid. Yeah, there's General there's General Custer. Okay, we've got some bandits and stuff like that coming across. I mean, I'll move everything out of the way. Um, we'll do some, uh, like I said, that dead foliage coming around. And maybe a bush foliage over there, over there, something like that. Okay, um, and there's them fighting it up. There's uh, the Long Ranger. There's the Long Ranger. Look. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you know, what I mean, a uh, bit of bushes around, stuff like that. Let's move over all that. Facing the right way. Yeah, what do you think? There we go. Look at that. Oh, I got a big green thing in the way there. Look, you know what I mean? Let's move some stuff out of the way. So that there's a scene that we can we can produce. <coughs> look at that. Yeah, look look at it. What do you think, guys? What do you got, guys? Yeah, yeah. Good night, Bright. Oh, Bright. Thanks, mate. Thanks for watching. Another bon the buttons to search for for, for uh, Duncan. Yeah, yeah. Good night, Bright. Thanks for again watching, mate. Stay tuned for us next week. Um, yeah, there we are. So there it is. Uh, that's quite wicked the end of the day, you know what I mean? We've got that bush. Oh, well, that bush goes by there, look. Like. Uh, yeah, tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's another bush type thing in it, you know what I mean? So a tree. So that's sort of the idea that we want we want to do. Yeah, you know what I mean? Um and that uh, and that diorama's come out quite nice at the end of the day as well. I'm quite chuffed with that one. Right. Um it worked out quite nice. Something totally different, something I've never done before. Yeah, worked out quite smart. And obviously then in front of the general store, uh, sorry, yeah, the general store then as well, it comes out. What the hell is Kelly? <laughs> what the hell is them, Kel? <laughs> yeah, and then with the figures, they, they look, it looks quite cool. 
So, um, there we go. There it is. Job done. Finished. I'm not going to do any more on that now because I think it's overkill. Yeah, and I don't like the overkill models. I like to... That the, sometimes, you know, we need... That, the, the art of modeling is to know when you're finished. Um, and I feel that that's finished. Yeah, you know what I mean? Um, we do any more to it, it's not gonna, it's not gonna work. Um, you chop my head off. Yeah, you know what I mean? <laughs> They're all giggling. I'm like, oh, what a I'll move that around so they can see it. Yeah, they oh, are. Wow, that's cracking. Look at that. Yeah, we see all the cameras and everything behind us and stuff. <laughs> you know what I mean? Don't worry, worry. We, we, we go and show it anyway. So, yeah. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for the support. Um, next week I might do. Yeah, uh, you. Yeah, you have done yourself there. Yeah, thanks, Carl. Yeah, you know, I mean, it, it's, it does look, it, it looks wicked. It's a good chuff. Um, <coughs> yeah, general store. Do a general store. Let me just quickly show you. Right, lid comes off. So this is for our war gamers, right? Lid comes off. Okay, we got, uh, I got models on there, so just be careful taking them off. Uh, that's what's inside. Yeah, so it's a nice little bit of detail inside. The doors work as well. Yeah, so the doors are open, swing open. Yeah, and the back door, uh, the back door swings open as well. You know what I mean? So it's uh, it, it's a nice bit of kit to be honest. It works a treat, uh, and it works a treat with that. So uh, you imagine now when we, we are going to bring out uh, war game inside of it, we are going to bring up more for it. So uh, the, you know what I mean? The photos of that now would be brilliant. Like, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, thanks Andy, guys. Um, stay tuned to Andy. Right, uh, two o'clock this afternoon. I think Andy. Right, you know what I mean. Some uh, some great streaming going on to that. Um, and uh, stay tuned with our, our, our cr crack on with your models. Yeah, you've got a week left or a couple of days left or whatever it is, um, uh, and go from there. Um, thanks for the support. Like I said, yeah, we had you know what I mean twenty odd people come in at once. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Seventeen likes. Happy days. Um, keep an eye out for when, when we get the merch. I don't know when we're going to get the merch. We'll try and we'll try and do as fast as we can. Uh, stay safe. Have a good one. Thanks very much of, uh, for joining. You guys are gonna have to end the stream because you've got the mouse. Um, oh, is it, is it Jess? Thanks, mate. Thanks for coming. See you soon. Bye, guys. See you.